Okay, here's my rather flat looking first landscape in Kodu. As you can see, I've got some distinct areas where I can add some things like trees and lakes and, and other bits and pieces in a, in a short while. But at the moment, what I'd really like to do is explore creating some hills so it isn't quite so flat. Now, the first thing I'm going to do is decide where I want my hills. I think I'm going to put them over here on this kind of peninsula bit. And I'm going to choose the um, Create Hills or Valleys option. And all I do is go over to where I'm going to it and hold down the left mouse button. But as you can probably just about see there, that's actually creating a rather rectangular sorry, square hill. So we can choose some different brush options. There we go. And I might have to actually pan round so I can see the other side to see that I'm creating an interesting kind of environment. The left mouse button raises hills, and the right mouse button sinks them. So once you've actually created um, some hills, what you can then do is choose the water tool and have a go at filling to actually make a lake. So I've made a little lake in there. Now for something like a river, we do a similar process, but we'd make a, a little valley that's really quite long, blocked at both ends, um, presumably either with um, some material that you've raised or with the edge of the terrain. And um, you can create yourself a little river then. And with the water, it's always it always flows down to the lowest point, just like kind of in real life, really. So that's why I've made myself that little lake bit there. And it's put my my Kodu landscape to life a bit by having the 3D element. <laughs> 